And now this is a story that you will see only on 12 News. A former Mesa cop accused of shooting an unarmed man to death. But body cam video is showing officers laughing and joking moments before the deadly shooting. So the question tonight is, how will that play with the jury? William Pitts has the story that you will see on just one station. A big part of Philip Brailsford's defense is that the situation was scary. He said he was terrified. But in this tape, in the minutes leading up to the shooting, the officers are joking, even laughing. In the elevator, on, in. on the way up to the fifth floor, the cops are smiling, giggling. Uh, we're just going to go up there and we're going to... You know. Daniel Shaver, a man they suspect of pointing a rifle at the window of the hotel room, is at the other end of the hall. They don't know how many people are in the room, how many guns, or what's happening inside. A situation so stressful, Brailsford said he feared for his life when Shaver was on the ground sobbing. But minutes before, jokes. Listen to my voice, so I don't have to send him the dog. If you talk to any combat veteran, um, they're going to tell you in stressful situations, humor is something that is widely used to kind of alleviate the stress of the situation. But in jury trials, perceptions are almost as important as the testimony. Defense attorneys like Russ Richelsoff say the jury might get a bad impression from this video, even if the jokes mean nothing. It doesn't mean that the attorneys, if this case goes to trial, that the attorneys at trial won't try to make something of it, and um, the juries may be concerned um, because there is some joking that may bring some question into whether or not you know he feared for his life. And the prosecution has already pointed out if Brailsford does say he was in fear for his life, why didn't any of the other cops that night say the same thing? Those are all things that could count when the case is before a jury, all hurdles Brailsford's lawyers have to cross. The key, convincing the jury that Daniel Shaver should have been shot. He doesn't need to feel fear for his life as he's you know going down the hallway. Um, where he does need to feel fear for his life is when he actually um, pulls the trigger, discharges his weapon, and, and shoots this man. Philip Brailsford is still out of jail. No bail was ever set in his case. He's pleaded not guilty to second-degree murder. In Mesa, William Pitts, 12 News.